And now we're in the kitchen with the best-selling author. Joanne Fluke's latest is called The Coconut Layer Cake Murder. It's full of intrigue and mysteries with a dash of recipes, too. And today she's in the kitchen with the scoop. How do recipes and murder mysteries mix, Joanne? Oh, beautifully. <laughs> I mean, when people are upset, they like to eat, right? So if you find a dead body, you have to go get a chocolate chip cookie or a chip off the old block. Why not? Now, this is actually, you've had, what, 25 of these best-selling mysteries. I mean, they've been turned into miniseries and more. Tell us the basics of, of who we're following here. Okay, we are following Hannah Swenson. She's a baker in Lake Eden, Minnesota, which is the murder capital of the world. Oh. There's a murder in every book. Sometimes <laughs> That's right. Too. It must be. And she bakes and she solves crimes and finds a lot of bodies, which her mother, Dolores, is not happy about. Oh, I can imagine. Yeah. Of course. Now, this latest, tell me about this story, the basics of what we're going to read. Okay. We are reading about Hannah helping her youngest sister's boyfriend, Lonnie, who works for the Sheriff's Department, Winnetka County Sheriff's Department. Which is made up, by the way. I mean, I hope there's not a Winnetka <laughs> County Sheriff's Department. You never Department. know. I don't, you might know by now. But Lonnie is the chief suspect in a murder. So he can't investigate. His partner can't investigate. And his brother is on the uh, detective detail. He can't investigate. So who's left? Hannah. Hannah. <laughs> so she's looking at this. You have a, a great cake, this coconut cake. That's a recipe that's in the book, which is amazing. But you're going to show us another recipe today from the book. I am. Okay, what are we looking at? We're looking at a recipe called Chips Off the Old Block. Mm. And they're right there. Destry's got her hand I on I know. Them. I was telling you, they're so, like, thin. I mean, they look great. So how do we make them? What are the ingredients? Oh, well, we start with butter and right. sugar. Of course. And it's kind of hard to mash in there, I realize. Go ahead. Okay, ready with the sugar? I got it. Okay. Okay, so I'm mashing this up. And I don't know why, but I see chips. Yeah, you're going to get part chips of the recipe. very All right. soon now. All right. Okay, we've got a little vanilla. We'll just put that in there. Okay. And we also have a little bit of molasses. Ooh, And right. I will tell you what happens with molasses. You don't have to buy brown sugar ever, ah. ever, ever. Just put some sugar, white sugar, in your mixer and mix in a little molasses until it's... And it it's, turns into brown sugar? Yeah, until oh, it's the right tip. color. All right. You know, that works. Okay. Okay, next ingredient would be eggs, which will make it easier to mix, right? All right. All righty. And then quickly, what's our other recipe? What, what do we have uh, Other left? ingredients? Whoa. We have potato chips crushed. And you smash these? Yeah. Okay. You can even do it with your hands. Let the kids and do it. And then pour them in? Yeah, uh, yeah. Okay. Okay. And then and finally? Okay. Finally, we have white chocolate and peanut butter chocolate chips. Okay. And if anybody's allergic to peanuts, use uh, butterscotch Something chips else. instead. Because right. it looks the same. Then throw oh, them in. And throw them in. Now we got flour. And oh. you put all that in. How long do you bake them for? Um, uh, uh, let's see. What is it? 12 to 15 minutes. Okay. At 350. Okay. And the recipe, again, is in the book. Coconut layer cake murder, everyone, which is great. And the best part is there's a big event. You can actually learn all about it by going to the Meet Angry and get your copy of Coconut Layer Cake Murder at the Poison Pen in Scottsdale tomorrow from 7 to 8 p.m. And for more information, go to joannefluke.com.